situation. <laughs> I'm in Norway in a place called Svol. Svolvea. I am struggling with this name to be honest. So this whole trip started two days ago when I got a text message from Joshua if I wanted to come to Norway to shoot a video with him. I have a really, really important client of mine that is in Norway as well, which I promised to see for quite some time. So I ran to the office because I wanted to pick up some watches and I needed to drop off a watch as well. Before we head towards the airport in Dublin, I need to drop off a watch at the office. It's Sunday, so the office is closed. So I've asked Mark to come in. Just come across the now. Okay. No worries, see you shortly. The stupid stuff about me is that I always lose everything, including keys. That means I'm not allowed to have any office keys because I lost two pairs already. <laughs> Marquis, how's it? Okay. Thank you for coming in, by the way. Of course. Jimbo, I need to get the box out of the Vacheron. Two things to do in the office, drop off a watch and picking up a watch. And the first thing I forgot, I'm a disaster. There it is. Vashon Constantin is in the office. Mark is trying to catch Stephen because there's a watch here I need to bring. We're finding it. We're finding the watch. Where can it be? Where can it be? Where can it be? Let her have it. No pops. Why is that called no pops? No bother, son. Look at this. There's an embargo on this watch. No one has seen this watch yet. Let me tell you one thing. This is absolutely indestructible. You can drive a truck over this and there's absolutely no problem with this. Thanks to you all, I have the possibility to show you this insane god tier watch. Let me present to you the new Casio MTG Aurora. And via this video, I'm asking your support to help me rename this watch from Aurora to the Barney something with a dinosaur. But I like Tinky Winky better, but... Barney is synonymous with Pepper. But I've never seen fucking Barney. Wow, what the fuck show prom? This watch is entirely solar powered, hand assembled, and of course, God tier! Right, that was loud, I'm sorry. Was that too loud? I think it was okay. Yeah, because it is fucking God tier. This is the only place where you can read about this watch or pre-order this watch. Do yourself a favor and don't miss this opportunity. Click on the link, I really appreciate your support. So watch I'm gonna need in Norway, because I'm not just gonna go to Norway civilization, just like Oslo and shit. No, I'm gonna go to these fucking mad islands. I needed a god tier. Thank you for your help. Appreciate that. Can you do me a favor? Sell this Vacheron. Yeah. That's what we need. We'll get that done. Race to the airport as well. You know what? Dublin Airport, Terminal 1, was always an absolute shithole, but they've completely redone it. That's actually brilliant. Didn't expect that. Big plus. Well done, Dublin. Horrendous welcome to Norway, what the f <laughs> Oh, that's me arrived in Norway. Saw my client, which I can't really show on camera. Because we're purchasing a big boy watch, a massively big boy, a seven figure watch. Something I can't really talk about right now, but I actually hope I can share this with you very soon. And after that, I thought it would be a really cool idea to have some drinks in Oslo with local subscribers. I've never done something like this. I've seen other YouTubers doing this and this got me the idea to, to really engage more with the subscribers and with you guys. Are you enjoying your pizza? Extremely good. Extremely good. Look at that. You say something in Norwegian, something dirty, will you? What are you wearing, son? God damn, motherfucker. Let her have it. Norway is good. Wow, that was absolutely insane. I want to do this more often, right? That I go to a city and just do a random Instagram post and want to invite a lot of subscribers. It was absolutely insane to hear everyone's story and to just talk about watches, have a bit of fun. Then I had the brilliant idea to basically fly you out. You're late. <laughs> How's it going? Yeah, everything has been a bit last minute, to be honest. You missed a good party, though. Did I? Yeah, it was good. It was go? Like 20 odd people, that's crazy, mate. That's crazy. So the cool thing is, during this meetup, someone that worked at a local authorized dealer invited me over to check out their shop. It was insane. I also bought an incredible watch there as well. Hello. How are you, bud? You well? How are you well? Ah, I'm doing well, doing well. Nice watch. Ah, you like it? Yeah. Would you like to do a trade? Uh... You have some toilet paper here, no? Fair play, how much is this? Uh, two, three, round? No, I'm joking, I'm joking. <laughs> this is the new Tudor Black Bay 54, because the Tudor Black Bay was not introduced in 1954, may I add. I wish I uh, was a few grams lighter. I am, so it's, it's perfect. <laughs> hey, fair enough. Can I have this book? Yeah, of course. Yeah, I haven't seen the new Tudor book yet. 
Let me see what else you have. This watch was released in Watches and Wonders, right? I've been hating on Tech Heuer for a long time, but I couldn't hate anymore. I think it's absolutely stunning. Which do you prefer, the black or blue? The black is definitely more wearable. I love how they've done that glass, done perfect. You know what? This place is very busy, and it is a Monday morning. I mean, that's incredible to see. I think this one is quite cool. I love that, the Smurf. No, I love that watch. I think that one is a really nice watch. If you can speak with your boss or whatever, if that is something, if that is for sale, I would buy that. To be fair, I'd rather have that than a Tech Heuer. No offense. I just got some news that if you would like this one, yeah, we can, you can get it. Done. Okay. Appreciate that. I love that dearly. 468,500 krone, krone with Apple Pay. For sure it will work. That's right. What's this? No. no I Bad sign. <laughs> Can I have the card? <laughs> Cheers. Which, oh, sorry. I bet you did. Did you? <laughs> you absolute <laughs> dog. Thank you so much. Bought a watch in Norway to memorize, of course, the Norway trip. A white gold Submariner reference number 126619 LB. Lunette Bleu. We had to jump on a flight towards this place where we are now. When you book a flight, you don't get an assigned seat. It is literally sit wherever you want type of plane. Like, it's like a bus, but then with wings. There it is, one of my worst nightmares ever. A fucking small drop plane. Nearly feels like I can touch that mountain. Made it, unbelievable. There we go, that's the bus station. And look at that scenery. That's unbelievable. What really blew my mind there is that it doesn't get dark. This is a fing mind. F I'm actually liking this. It's 11 in the evening. I've never ever seen that in my life. That's fing mind blowing. We walked out of the restaurant and it's like, it's 11 in the evening. And it's still fing light. This is a mind. F and then after dinner, Josh just crashed in the hotel, went into the kitchen to start cooking this fing random crap. Holy f that looks fing horrendous. Nico, give a little tickle. Yeah, it's scary as f He just grabs it like it's nothing. Here, put your finger in. No, no, I'm it's not going dead. there. It's dead. I just want you to see no, it. No, 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 you're, you're gonna fing. I'm not gonna do anything. Look. You're fing with me. Ah! <laughs> How much would that crab cost? $900. $900 for a crab? Oh, that sounds so dirty. What the f? He's pissing. What the fuck? He's pissing. How is this possible? <laughs> you like that, Nico? Mm. I thought you liked crap. I've never had crap. Anything with mayo says nice, doesn't it? <laughs> Just that simple. What am I going to do this? Can I, I want to have a look. Oh, smell this. Nico will fully shit his pants and then be like, oh, what, what's going on in this room? What's going on in this room? Right, do you think it's appropriate to steal one cookie? It's inappropriate. This one is Nutella, I think. Don't say that to me. And then very early this morning, we went to this incredible museum. I'm actually supposed to help Josh with this video, right? But I'm, I'm just annoying him. Got this. If I were to fart right now, do you think you would catch flame? To be fair, if they're gone, I'll try. <laughs> they, didn't, they didn't say you could touch this. You just ask first. Okay. Isn't that hard? Can I, no, but how stupid is it? Hey, sir, can I put that mask on? Here. No, you <laughs> Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. The white version of Kanye West. <laughs> no, I don't know you want to be that. The okay. male version of Kim Kardashian. There you go. Yeah. <laughs> no, I haven't looked That's at your booty big. yet. Hey, it's man. big. <laughs> Pull my fingers on. No, absolutely not. I'm chilling here in Norway, lying in the back of the truck, feeling like a proper hillbilly slash Viking. I'm loving this. Couldn't be better. I'm thinking about a career change.
the next day. My shed at home is bigger than this airport. It's five in the morning, five minutes past five, and it's still bright, and that's the smallest airport in the world, meaning it's gonna be as well one of the smallest planes in the world. I am petrified for these fucking small planes with sticks, the propellers. Start making up lies about it just to scare Josh. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. You, you didn't exactly hype me up with it. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, the size of these planes are insane. I hope it doesn't fall out of the sky. Like, it has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight windows. Eight windows. So there's some sort of mathematical equation you want me to do that? No. Oh, thank you. No. Okay, no. You should sit next to an emergency exit. Cool. Oh. <laughs> <Yeah>, no. <laughs> <laughs> My heart rate is up to 110. Quick, quick, I'm on there. Come on now. Let's go to four percent. It's only eight minutes. Electronic. Only a lot of events of an emergency evacuation. <laughs> 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 Still your tray table and safety belt. Probably not. It'll probably end on a hard cub him showing his ass. <laughs> Go shop at God's here. Okay. Oh.